before the storm, I had just issue with the tree in general, just because the sidewalk was all broken up. Okay, right, right. So that was an issue that had been ongoing, and obviously the tree roots were an issue. October 29th, we had a big snowstorm. The trees were still full of leaves. The snow took the tree over in that direction. The tree took my water pipe up, and I called the town. I complained to um, the water company. Nobody came out and did anything until it was December 16th, three o'clock in the morning, when they came and knocked on my door, and the town and the United Water Company shut off my water at three o'clock in the morning. They shut off my water because the water now was no longer water, but it was ice. Because it was ice, it was now a hazard. And because it was a hazard, they shut off my water. I was flipping out. I mean, are you kidding me? But this first question the guy from the United Water asked me is, do you have home surf? And I said, yeah, I do, I have leak guard. So with that, fortunately, they came out and they started the dig out. Tremendous guys that you sent out to my house, a crew of like three guys, started a dig out from where the tree was. Now the tree was still here. The tree was still here at the time. Uh, this tree was only been removed recently because I still had a, my issue would still go, be ongoing if the tree was still there. So the tree is now subsequently been gone. But they dug out from here, up through here, over here, broke cement here, over to the front of the house. So it was 70 feet long and about seven to 10 feet deep. And it was a trench. And it was just before Christmas. I had all these plans going on, all this mud going on. But in the end, they laid 70 feet of copper, you know, and it's all brand new. And if I didn't have home serve, I wouldn't have been able to afford that. I'm a single mom. I got teenagers in my house. Water issue is huge. Um, actually, home serve found a way around that too for me too. I have a wonderful next door neighbor and we were able to tap the water from spigot to spigot. And they kept me afloat for the two weeks because I was in a panic not having water with five people and five adults in the house <laughs> and teenagers who shower twice a day and such and dishes and food to be cooked. Uh, they really saved my life.